anything new for a while. There have been so much going on this summer, but I am happy to announce that <clears throat> as you can see, I've bought Rogue Galaxy this morning, and uh, I'm very happy because it's payday today, yay! <laughs> it's really good. Oh my god, I love that song. Huh? Can I continue? Can I? Oh no, no I can't. Oh well, okay. <laughs> anyway. Let's... So... Let's start a new game, shall we? I think. This will be fun. Let's read the story here. Story. The war that divides the Garrity has cast its shadow upon the distant desert planet Rosa. Highly valued for its natural resources, Rosa has been put under direct control of Lundering Federation, an attempt to prevent invasion by the Empire. Undergrind's watchful eye, the enslaved Rosans are now find themselves forbidden to leave. How unfair! Forbidden to leave? I'm already in love with this game already. Uh, this is our character. He's a scavenger. It's quite interesting. Trapped within this desert wasteland, the sands of time blow ceaselessly. But it's not going to end like this. I'm going to find my way out of here. I swear it. Hmm. Wishful thinking there, buddy. And here we are heading back to Ro Rosa, I believe. But, uh... You sure he's in this backwards bumpkin <laughs> town? Oh, it's these the two. information came from a credible source. He's here, all right. He should be hiding out somewhere on Rosa. Desert Claw. He's one of the galaxy's top hunters. Maybe he got his mitts on a load of dosh and he's off living it up somewhere. Can't believe he'd be wasting his time on this slave rock. Don't worry, he's somewhere on this planet. My instincts are infallible. Like I'm gonna trust a robot's instincts. I would if I were you. They're quite uncanny. Besides, I can use this to determine whether or not he's the real deal. Just leave it to Steve, all right? Really? Well, the captain will be pretty cheesed off if we don't find him. So you'd better come through on this. I know, I know. Hmm. We'll be meeting those two later. A little bit later. Rosa. Oh dear. The music's great on this, isn't it? Here we are. What are those two things for me? Tuckered out, huh? You did well, boy. Two medium-sized mish. Okay, pal, you met your quota. And here's your pay. Huh? Is that all? Can't you spare a little extra? We didn't bring that much with us, you know. 
<laughs> Besides, slaves like you should be grateful we even bother to share our rations. <laughs> I'm not doing this for my health, you know. Mm. You can stop your cheesy grin right there, sir. This is all that I got today. Those long guardians are getting a little too big for their britches. You gonna let them get away with it? No, no. Don't get so worked up over it. It's been two years since Rose has been under Longardian rule. They're still struggling to get used to this place. We'll get our chance soon enough. <sighs> Man, why did Rosa have to get mixed up in this war? <sighs> it used to be such a peaceful planet. The Lone Guardians aren't all bad, though. Now that their lookouts are posted at the gate, we never get beasts in town anymore. But the that whole reason they're change. posted there is to keep an eye on us. Mm. What the hell? What the? Seems I spoke too soon. There's a beast in town. A pretty big one by the looks of it. All right, I'll take care of it. Jaster, wait. Don't worry, I'll behave. <laughs> You'll behave? Really? 